Hello, I'm Alberto Real Fernandez and I present Team Apps for Designing Courses based on Smart Learning, along with Rafael Molina Carmona and Farron Jorens Laro. When designing a course inside a learning platform, there are different aspects to consider. How the learning content is displayed, how the learning process works, how the students interact with it, and it is important to know the learning, the learning model features and how a course implements it. So, to analyze that, we propose the use of a TM app based on a learning model called CAM. CAM is a customized adaptive learning model based on two main concepts. The competence, that is the skills or the knowledge the students acquire, and the activities, the different tasks they will perform to acquire these competencies. Uh, competencies are displayed in a form of a directed graph that we define as a competence map, we call it. And uh, we can, so we can see here with different competencies on our concrete course, connected by these uh, dependencies. And um, <coughs> the students sorry, will, will advance across this map, unlocking, one comp unlocking competencies by performing activities. This is the sample of, uh, of CAL implemented in a learning platform. So, from CAM, we define four principles to be analyzed. First, it's an active learning, that learning is acquired by, by doing activities, by doing tasks. Autonomy, because the, the learner has complete autonomy of their own learning process. It's an adaptive learning model. And supervision, because, because it is also used as a complete teaching tool. And a technological ecosystem map is a polygonal representation of the main elements of a technological ecosystem. We have here the different elements. First, the facets, that is each size of the pyramid that represents the principles to be analyzed in different levels of attractions, abstraction, and the components are the concrete aspects that are affected by it. For this concrete case, we define four facets. On the, for the chain map, that are the four principles we defined before, and four different levels of abstraction. The theoretical level, the, where they are, the principles are based, the model level defined by, by CAM, how the platform implements them, and the means of the, means of the course that have uh, implemented these different principles. So, for each facet, in each abstraction level we define the components. In our example we use we have analyzed only one of the principles on only one side of the pyramid as we can see here for this research with the different components divided in and um, represented by different maturity levels. This maturity level represents how the how each component is fulfilled. Okay so for example for the um, theoretical level in this case or maybe with the, for this concrete component that is from that is part of, of autonomy principle, we have learning learning paths in the in the model level that is in the maximum maturity level. Okay, then directed graph that is how the platform is uh, implement these these um, this principle for using uh, for allowing the students use different learning paths. Okay. But we have here that the course, the, the course design of the that is represented by the competence map design, is not completely fulfilled. It, this is in a low maturity level. So um, we have, we should have maybe to improve this part. Uh, on the other hand, this this component, that is the, there are the, um, the activities created of the with the real time progress that is almost fulfilled, and in the course level created activities that the that the teacher has created are almost in the in the maximum maturity level. So we have found a tool to represent to analyze the learning principles from the different learning from different learning features, how they are fulfilled by using a team app and uh, it is we think it is a useful vision of the course design. So uh, our for uh, for future studies, we would like to complete the rest of the principles to have a, a complete vision of the course design in this platform. Thank you very much.